Hello, snowboarders of the internet. I'm your host, Avery Lefebvre, and this is Top Fives, the only weekly top five show in snowboarding that you might be watching right now. I don't know. There might be others. I don't pay attention to these things. Anyways, in this episode, we're going to be talking about the top five all mountain free ride boards for women for 2022 2023. That's right, ladies. All 3.4% of you that tune into this channel are getting your own top five list. So let's dive into it. Unless your name's Crystal. No girl's named Crystal allowed. Unless it's Crystal Quinn. That's it. Number five, the LibTech Dynamis. Mild taper, C3 profile, so you get that nice flat section after the camber comes down. So it lets you really just push off that tail as it sinks down, driving that turn. You got magnet traction for when it's really icy out. It's gonna give you that added grip to it. Overall, this board just crushes through chunder. You can just ride the whole mountain. You can even go in the park if you absolutely have to with it and not worry that it can handle it. But it does lean more towards the free ride side of things. Number four, the Jones flagship. Cam rocker profile, so you get that camber underfoot that's gonna give you all the load, snap, and drive from the board. But you got that rocker in the tip with the setback, so that way what's gonna happen is when you're planing and pow, it's gonna funnel it back out, as well as give you ease of entry into turns. And then you got their magnet traction, serrated edge, whatever the hell they're calling it these days because it changes every year. It's gonna give you added grip when you get into just chunkier, icier, firmer snow. You're not gonna have to worry about it. It's versatile enough to take you from the peak to the park, through the pow, and everything in between on the resort for you. Number three, the Rome Ravine. A little more directional for you, so you've got a little shorter a bit of tail from when you're pushing off of a carb or you're just trying to sink it down. It does have that nice setback in it, so the nose is gonna plane better in pow. It has a great side cut for just railing turns when you're on a groomer. You never really have to worry about that. It's always just gonna feel locked in, and it's camber dominant throughout you're just going to feel that power that snap for sudden side hits launching cat track gaps or even when you're just porpoising in fresh powder number two the yes hell yes a little bit stiffer than some of the other ones on this list but not so stiff that it's a death plank you do have a directional cam rocker and you do have their underbite technology so what that's going to do with that directional cam rocker is give you more rocker in the nose than the tail that's going to cause more optimal powder float for you and it gives you a better ease of entry into turns now that underbite it allows you to steer right underfoot right at the inserts it's going to grip in on firmer snow and you're really going to be able to lay a deep carve with it honorable mentions all great options but just barely didn't make it in the top five of this list the ride magic stick the niche sonnet the battalion storm all great options but just barely didn't crack the top five of this list and the number one women's all mountain free ride board for 2022-2023 is the k2 cold shoulder Camber dominant, little bit of rocker in there, just gonna give you that more optimal powder float. Side cut super dialed on this board. You can really just set that edge and really push off that tail, driving those carbs. It's gonna be good in powder, good in the trees, good on a groomer. Still handle the park if you absolutely have to go in there. I don't know why you're doing that on an all mountain free ride board, but you ladies can do whatever you want. You don't need to listen to me, I'm just a guy. I've got outdoor plumbing, not indoor plumbing, so why the hell are you even listening to me? Anyways, this was our number one pick for this year. This has been my top five list for women's all mountain free ride boards for 2022, 2023. Do you agree? Do you disagree? Do you own one? Are you gonna buy one? Leave me a comment down below. I'm sure some guy is gonna come in and try to mansplain to me that I was mansplaining to you even though I wasn't mansplaining to you. So we'll just check those comments and find that absolutely hilarious. Anyways, if you're new here, remember to subscribe, click the bell, get those notifications. That way you're not gonna miss any of the videos we got coming out for all you snowboarders of the internet. And if you really like what we're doing over here and you wanna support us further, swing on over to Angry Snowboarder VIP and become a member. Sure, I could tell you more here, but I got a video over there that explains it so much better. This has been Top Fives and I've been your host, Avery Lefebvre. I mean, I'm gonna probably have to continue to be your host because no one else wants this job, ladies. Probably because like we only pay in bagel bites. But if you wanna like get paid in bagel bites and talk about women's snowboards, you should probably reach out. Anyways, I'll see you in another video.